Hi, what's up guys? I'm back with my 24 Revolvo 1988. So it's been uh, two months now and uh, I stopped driving uh, the 240 because it's not safe anymore. So the car needs a lot of work. So I'm gonna share some of the things that I'm gonna replace on the Volvo 240. So mostly it's gonna be suspension parts and front brakes. All rusted. So it's been many years that I didn't replace the brakes. And now everything is done. The pads worn out, completely worn out. No more pads left, reaching the metal. I have a loose ball joint, a cracked hose, the shocks as you see in the video at first, the car is bouncing. I need a new tire at end, stabilizer bar bushing. So all these parts, all these parts are going to go on the 240 Volvo. Starting with the brake calipers. These are the new brake calipers with new pistons inside. New rotor, brake pads, pin kit, all four hoses. And what is related uh, with the suspension, new coil spring, shock absorber. This shock absorber is an insert. It's not a strut, it's an insert. We have to remove the assembly to replace that. New bump stop, new back plates, new outer inner tire add ends. This is the inner tire add end. Outer tire at end, a new, new wheel bearing. I'm gonna start with the brakes. I'm gonna remove the calipers and uh, remove the, the wheel hubs and the back plates. So I think it's gonna be enough for today and hopefully I will do the rest during this week. So first I'm gonna cut the holes, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut the holes, I'm gonna let the fluid drip. So I'm gonna let the brake fluid drip. And uh, I'm gonna start removing the caliper, stunting from the other side. So I'm removing the, the caliper completely, so I'm not, I don't have to remove the pads or something because I'm replacing the caliper. I already preheated the bolts, so to make things faster, so the two bolts is preheated already. When, when you see a lot of rust, it's uh, always better to preheat the bolts. So I'm gonna start by removing the, the pipe. So the upper one is coming out easy. Second one is binding a little bit, so I'm going back and forth to loosen up. One is out, almost out. The second one too is out. Millimeter. 
Remove the two 19 mm bolts is holding the caliper. And we're gonna pry and remove the caliper. So that's how to remove the caliper. As you see inside, the pad is all completely finished. The pad is completely done. As you see, I have a wheel bearing noise too on it. The wheel bearing is, is done. So we're gonna remove the 10 millimeter. Use a chisel to remove the, the cap. I'm closing this up. So this uh, remove the other ten millimeter. So take a hammer and this is right under the As you see, the, the rotor is badly rusted and is stuck on the hub. So we're going to see how we're going to take it. So this is the uh, worst case right now and I'm going to use... Uh, I need a grinder. I'm going to use the grinder to cut, make a cut over here and remove the disc. I made a cut with the grinder, so I'm going to hit it with the hammer and uh, try to split the, the rotor in, in half. I hit it with the hammer. So already loosened up. And the disc came out. As you see, it was full of rust and it was grabbing a little bit, so with the help of the grinder, so it came out. Remove the cutter pin, we're gonna put a new one afterwards. Undo the, the knot. This is one of the wheel bearing, the small one, and there's a bigger one in the back that we're gonna replace, of course, in the next video. So remove the, the wheel bearing, this is the inner one. millimeter socket one two and three and remove the back plate this is how bad is the back plate on the car so this is the first part of the video Still, we have to we have to remove the 
the strut assembly. After replacing the strut assembly, I'm going to redo the brakes because uh, it's easier like that because I'm doing uh, more than one task in the, in the same area. So if you still uh, if you still have your 240 Volvo and uh, and you like to know what kind of problems you're gonna have in your car, so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching.